some of your delicious cooking oh. today. Oh, what are you making? I am making three things. A warm sandwich served with a hot cocoa and we finish with ice cream. It's a menu of varying temperature. Sounds delicious. Hey, this is a great time to learn about hot and cold and warm. Excellent! Let's start with the drink. Mmm, I love hot cocoa, but I have to be careful in drinking it too fast because it is a hot drink. Do you know what hot means? Oh, I can help here. Hot means that the temperature is high, like on a summer day when the sun is out. Hot things can burn you if you're not careful. Great! Other things that can be hot are the sun, an oven, an iron, or a fire. Yes, and many more things. Now, let's look at that ice cream. That's something that is not hot. It is cold. Cold is when the temperature is very low and freezes things. When you feel cold, you usually want to put on a jacket. Other cold things are ice, freezers, and snow. Yes, so we know hot and cold. Maybe you can describe what warm is. Sure, when something isn't hot or cold, it can have a different description. When something is only a little hot, it can be referred to as warm. So my warm sandwich is only a little hot, so I can touch it without being hurt. It's not fully hot or fully cold. It's only a little hot. Other warm things can be how it feels under your bed covers or when someone gives you a big hug. Oh, what happens if something is a little cold? That means something is cool, correct? Other cool things can be when you stand in front of a blowing fan or you have melted ice cream. Melted ice cream? Oh, there will be none of that here. Uh, quickly, let's eat it up. I won't argue with that. Au revoir. Well, thanks for joining. Bye for now. Mwah. Keep smiling.